erosion as such, I think there is no uh, necessity to define it or share the impact on the asset integrity. But at least I believe, and uh, many of you also have the same <coughs> opinion, that corrosion is an unknown fear, which is still to be known fully. A major part of the global investment, which has happened earlier, happened now, and going to happen in future, is threatened by corrosion. So, if I say so, that corrosion <coughs> directly affects, directly impacts the GDP growth of not only one nation, but every nation of the globe. India, uh, we have developing country and we are in the process of putting a lot of infrastructure which includes several structures and if proper in a proper way this Canadian balance is not being taken care of at the initial stage itself then we are also propagating a tremendous loss for our country and the generations coming in future. In NDPC, we are a 73 gigawatt company, 73 gigawatt plus, and the assets built by us are of more than a lakh crore rupees. And that asset belongs to each and every citizen of this country because we are a public company and it is the, on the based on the public money this asset has been built. So while we want to spare it to have some control and protection from this corrosion, but this problem cannot be solved by NTPC alone. And this is the reason why we are looking for great organizations and stalwarts in this industry and academia to come forward and help not only NTPC but the nation as a whole. It is very important that in a scientific way we develop mechanisms, strategies and solutions which are built on strong fundamentals to minimize the impact if it cannot be made zero. And in NDPC, we are committed to provide whatever support the academia, the experts need. We are fully open in sharing the data, having the physical visits of our programs, as well as required. But Corrosion is a silent killer. When I use the word killer, let me just 
let's give a small example. See, in a power plant, to generate power, many subsystems have to run in an integrated manner. And then only the power is generated. And this is an online process. Now, with this background, it is most important that we have continuous addition of power. Now, this corrosion, the effect and the impact of corrosion on the structures, it's such a silent phenomenon. that the people who are there in maintaining the plant, who are present there 24 by 7, when they are, every day they are seeing the change, they are unable to detect it. And what is happening? <coughs> one sudden day, one structure malfunctions, also for develops. Then the entire production is stopped, power generation is stopped, and these commercial units immediately undergo the loss. <coughs> Not only the generation loss, but once the problem erupts, then there is an expert team to detect the extent of damage due to corrosion. And after det detecting it, taking the necessary resources of procurement and then putting back into place. So this is a long phenomenon. And it all amounts to commercial loss for a company like us, but all the consumers who are getting this power. So this needs to be controlled and have some solution. One of the, based on the whatever we know, one of the ways that if we can predict them, share the problems, and also share the best practices <coughs> which they were adopted in tackling this. These are all not full fledged complete solutions. It is very important that when we join hands, help the silence between us and contribute. Every stakeholder in this movement to their knowledge, to their experience, to their data and the case studies. <laughs> it is only possible when all this amalgamate and people are focused in giving a solution to this great problem. So, I could not join there, but I am sure all the industry experts, the persons who are affected from the corrosion, the academia, or have all assembled there, and request that they should discuss not only the gravity of the problem, but they should also come out with a strategy, with a time-driven strategy that how this problem can be solved so that the monster of corrosion which is zooming at us, we can tame it. It's very important. With this, I wish all the best and success for to this conference. Thank you very much.
thank you mr venkatesh gupta it was a very delightful insight to uh, the details of how you deal with corrosion uh, we would now like to move on to a quick coffee break and then we will reconvene at the earliest uh, please enjoy our break at the moment